Hey y'all, just slid into Texas. Late start like normal. Once we get to this lease we're going to, we're going to drive back into Louisiana. So, looking to be a fun weekend, warm weather. See if we can catch some fish, eat some fish. Got some deer steak all marinated up. We got one of the young'uns coming out here with us this weekend. So, fun, packed, and exciting. Here we come. All right, y'all. We are here. Little piece of oasis off of 12 Mile Bayou. This is gonna be the spot. Gotta clear out all this stuff. Make sure there ain't no copperheads. Always fun to wake up with a copperhead. There's some old paracord. Yeah, there to there. check the fishing line real quick. I'll be right back. Oh, can y'all hear that wind? It's like 10, 12. We didn't eat breakfast. They out there sitting up some yo-yos. Getting the post to start raining here. Today. So... Started a little bit. We got some wood already under the under, under the top or whatever. I got a feeling it's blowing in. Oh! No, where are my friends? Oh, y'all still with me? Yeah, that wind serious. He kicked up out of nowhere. I mean, when you got hot coals like this, you don't need to actually, you don't, if you don't just necessarily need the fire, like it's not cold, we don't necessarily need the fire. So, I mean, you don't have to do anything like this right here. This is a nice little fire start, and you just put that on top of the, the wind blowing, so that's good. It's blowing good, so it's giving it a lot of oxygen. And it eventually, it eventually ignite that fire. let smoke we're getting and I'm not doing any kind of setup any kind of fire setup I'm just kind of stacking the wood that leaf had a lot of uh bacon grease on it so grease yeah That's how hot those coals were still. Little wind, little grease, and we have fire. 
That's nice. Oh lord. I get a little grease on the phone. Okay. I got the I got it close enough to the fire yeah. Can you feel it? Can you feel the fire? You're getting warm, put your hands up there. He had a little run in last night with uh somebody that's on the lease, I guess. He wasn't very nice, so we we not we wasn't gonna record it. But to make a long story short, they was illegally hunting anyway. And so as I tell people, I'm snitching. I told it. We told it this morning when we talked to the guy. When we talked to Ricky, so. That's not okay, y'all. Illegally hunting. Uh, things like that. Abusing people's uh, kindness. Taking that, trying to take their kindness for weakness. That's not cool. Like, we wouldn't have half the problems we have with we're keeping the land and everything right and, and animals if we if we had people that was doing the right thing. So we don't advocate that. You know, it's been a, I know it's been a lot of people that's been on there. It's been some folks that did some bad things. They trying to get some footage. I guess uh like this year we not I finna make nothing up. And I don't care how much like that's that's what entertainment, that's what TV is for. Like, this is more reality, like the real reality, not that uh, fake reality that they got scripts for. When we come out here and we camping, it's real. So, uh, there's no there's no script for it. I write scripts when we're talking about products and stuff because I, I want to make sure that it's right. But when you when we out here camping, there ain't no script to that. Like if I don't if I don't wanna get up in the middle of the night and I get up, I'm pretty sure a lot. If I don't wanna get up and I don't wanna record, I'm not fancy. It's just So y'all to get what I got. And I'm I'm not gonna cheat you out of anything, but at the same time it's like don't don't do stuff that ain't right. It messes it up for everybody. One of the biggest reasons why we come out and camp and hunt and fish is really not, it, we enjoy it, but it's also about living you, and surviving. Like, you need to know how to survive. So we want our kids to know how to survive. The way the world's going, we, we might not be in no house. We might, we might be in a tent, a little tarp or whatever it is, you know? So we kind of take that part seriously. So. Rain, sleet, and snow, we gonna be here. I'm trying to do it the right way. Cause you wanna you wanna conserve as much as possible. There's a reason we have hunting laws and there's a certain season you can hunt certain things because you wanna allow the wildlife to continue to grow to replenish so you can live off of the land and off of the animals. The next thing we want to get into is that planting crops. Like I told y'all before, just to give y'all a little rundown of the camp. Some of the biggest things that I talked about, basic necessities. So, cooler people, if you need a cooler. Trash bag, right? Get your trash up. Uh, we didn't, we... Sean found these chairs, so, and they were on sale. Huh, where you bought these chairs from? Academy? Anyways, I think he got them from Academy. We first seen them at Academy, and they were, like, too expensive, and we weren't finna buy them, but they was on sale, so he ended up getting us two of these wide chairs. Uh, obviously, we got the little chair for the, for the little one. But... I literally got off work, picked the kids up, uh, took them back to the house, let them get stuff to be at the grannies. My uh, 
My youngest was already uh out here. His daddy picked him up. When he came back out, he had already set up camp. And then I threw my stuff in there. Uh, let's see. I got a little dry lint just in case. It's supposed to rain, like I said, so that'll make it a little bit easier. Um, I got a face towel and it's soap in here, y'all. I just used that to wash up. Um, that big blue container over there is water. We got some water in there, so we're using that. We'll leave tomorrow, so it's not like we're gonna be out here a long time. But I, so I've been using that to to clean up. I I just felt extra dirty. I think that was because I was running around yesterday and never got a chance to really do anything. But this is my little. It's my little Ella P. So, ladies, we can stand up and pee. We can stand up and pee. That helps. When you gotta go, you gotta go. You know? But I got I got an extra pair. Of, I got some socks in there. Two pairs of socks, a pair of pants, shirt. Uh, I think another tank top. Um, what did you say? It is, it is warm. D -d don't worry about it, baby. Uh, it is warm out here, so, uh, we keep us a couple handguns. It's, uh, Snake Sentry, and, uh, we, they say it's a lot of hogs out here, so. You got these chairs from Academy, right? Yes. Okay. So, yeah. But, yeah. So, what I was talking about, the basics. Oh, we got a light over there. Let me see. Can you get my shirt? You ain't got no case, though. You ain't got no case. Oh, you was working on a case of Pepsi. <laughs> uh, uh, but, yeah, we got... I got the basics that I told y'all about. All right. Uh, we got little, little pad, sleeping pad. And you can see my son brought both his books. He said he's going to read both of them by tomorrow. I doubt that. Uh, he been busy running around. He, he just came off. He just got out the boat with. You heard these things from the Uh-uh, no, not yet. How many you put out, baby? Four or five. Four or five. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so. Uh. Since since Hunter got picked up straight from school, he got his school backpack and and his bag that his daddy had packed the night before, and then and then Sean got his bag. So we got one bag of pee. Well, he got two bags, and then we got our sleeping pads, three sleeping bags. Mine the thickest because I'm always cold, and we got some snacks. We got this new uh oh, so some kind of. Skittles drink? Little packets? Let's see. This is our this is our camping uh well we use our little monkey box to keep stuff in there. We got some machetes. We got our we got our little uh emergency blankets that we use just in case. We got some beans in here. A lot of the dry stuff to keep in here. Yeah, like yesterday, uh, he, I know I got some footage while he was cooking, but that we had deer backstrap yesterday. Um, that was really good. Hunter had him son. He said it tastes exactly like Skittles. You know, I thought about it. Nobody ever really shows how they clean up, I guess. But the shortest pan had grease in it. I see me use that to, I broke it up and then um, poured it on the fire. Then I put some water in it so we could boil it. I got some water there to clean the dishes, the plastic pieces that I can't put on the, on the fire. This pan here had eggs in it. I mean, I could use a dew wipe or something to wipe it up. But, and usually it's good to have a piece of foil. Some kind of foil, you ball that up. You make that and your scrubber.
the ring. Oh, that's good, because I'm almost done. Yeah. Oh, my bad. What you trying to do, babe? I'm fixing to run a line to that, but I'm using this as well, so what y'all thought would be pretty cool. So, yeah, you always want to have, try to have at least two uses for anything you bring, because ounces equals pounds equals pain. Give us some space underneath here. And not only that, but by making it tighter, the water won't pull up on the Oh, look at this. Does it line up with that other one? Yeah, almost. Oh, I guess. <laughs> That'll work. I'm gonna be ready to take a nap here in a minute. I did a lot of weird. <laughs> you washed a few dishes, go and wash yourself. That was hard. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of you to wash. Oh, I'll be back with y'all. I'm gonna talk to him real bad. <laughs> That look to myself. That's it. That's every day for you, ain't it? No. With me. Oh. I'm sorry. I thought you was gonna catch it. <laughs> Stop playing by the fire. That's so childish. Put me some water in there. Rinse it out first, baby, before you. Uh, okay. Friend, it's not completely underneath here, but what? The fire. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Not too shabby, baby. Not too shabby. Looks good. Let's see. Let's see from a, a wider angle. 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 That's our setup. That ain't too bad. Here. Oh. Which one are you giving me? It's a surprise? I can't see it anyway, baby. You know I ain't got no glasses. Don't throw the thing on the ground. You don't see the now, y'all better be using that trash bag I got. The trash bag who got? Oh, you got it, baby. You set up the camp. Excuse me. I apologize. Yeah. <laughs> Probably not going to keep any of that anyway. you gotta look for it, but there's always a nice little rake out there. <laughs> Why well, kick him with your legs or I can't get him to break at the house. It's too easy. Sad, ain't you? No. Can't break. We've been breaking up all this long wood so we can have it ready to put on that fire. All the wood we couldn't break by hand and foot. I'm exhausted. Yeah, me and Hunter been we've been at this for about an hour. What, 30 minutes?
He was at it for 30 minutes, I know, by itself. You, you come do this since you are doing it. Come on. I got, I got witnesses, y'all. Witnesses lie. Listen, <laughs> I got witnesses. He said, come do something since you were doing that. Y'all see my feathers? We went on the walk. <laughs> Recording him. Recording him. Because he did nothing. Well, I ain't going. Okay, he's showing out. We had to use a tree to break it. What a wonderful phrase. Ladies, if y'all can't break them sticks, man, if you can't break them sticks or them logs or whatever, I can't break this. You ain't got no ratchet, you got trees. As long as you can brace it through something and and a, distribute that that pressure and that weight. Don't use that one. No, use the one. The other one we was using down at the bottom, baby. Go to the go as far as you can. He ain't gonna listen to us. He gonna do what he wanna do. It's slim the uh at the top. I mean as long as he gets the job done. As long as he gets the job done. Can't go. Scout frustration and impatience. Just put it in the box. Yeah, that's good. Go get that one. Go get that one. I'm not scared of that. I got a bath wall. <laughs> Go get that one. I'm good. Some of your handles. I can't. I can't do it on dirt. How do you expect me to do it on dirt? That's all I need to get that. He stay on his phone and be laid up. Oh, it's Sunday. We cleaning up. Trying to get these pots and pans boiled and clean. Got nothing to wipe them up with. Doing, doing some scrubbing. I didn't start at the rain on us. Is that a lot easier? Mm -hmm. That's not? Mm -hmm. uh, Hunter, you better do it with some control.
trip down y'all y'all know the rotation you ain't surviving if you ain't living you ain't living if you ain't surviving don't go to work every day don't work for these people and don't do nothing spend your time with your family your money whatever it is you want to do paying bills that ain't the only thing you here for so make it count see y'all next one i'm out